fight. I will fight. Daniel Judah, I will fight you. Come and fight. I will fight you. Come across this line. I'm a man. I am coming. No man can see her. No man can see. Come here. I will fight you. Come and fight. Come across this line and fight. I'm from the American world. Don't finish you. Watch, 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 watch what will happen now. I know where the power is. Just watch. I'll fight. Wise man Daniel, the founder of Elohim Ministries Worldwide, the spiritual son of Prophet T.B. Joshua during the crusade at Lusaka, Zambia, which was recorded live. He came face to face with a rage, demonic, oppressive force. Three years I've been, I've been eating soy and ice cubes. For how long have you been eating chalk? For 25 years. What do you want Jesus to do for you? I want to be dead. At okay, and his soil and ice cube. Okay. Go! 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 I'll fight you! I will fight you! I will fight you! I will fight you! Daniel, let me face you to man! I'm a man! Yeah, I'm a man! I'm a man! From West Indies! From West Indies? West Indies! I'll fight you! She's mine! Who are you? Huh? Who told you to come to Zambia? Why you don't want me to come to Zambia? I'll fight you. Why you don't want me to come to Zambia? You will not deliver her. She is mine. She's I'll yours. I'll fight you. Huh? I've tormented her. How do you torment her? Oh, sickness, rejection, Lima! nothing. You say you want to do what? I'll fight you. Oh yeah, come and fight. I'll fight you. Lima! I'll fight you. Leave her. Come and fight. Come and fight! I will fight you! Come across this line. I'm a man! I am coming! No man can see her! No man can see! Come here! I will fight you! Come and fight! Come across this line and fight! I'm from the American world! Don't finish you! Watch, 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 what will happen now? I know where the power is, just watch. I'll fight you. Just watch. Go. In Jesus' name. Leave Go. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Leave her. Thank you, Lord. Amen. 23 God, years of addiction to eating and healing and ice cubes. The demonic spirit, in so much rage, questioned the man of God. Why do you come to Zambia? The evil spirit said he will beat the hell out of the man of God, wise man Daniel. Because he is a man and he owns the beautiful lady. Thus, the man of God is not allowed to deliver her. The man of God was okay with a challenge for a battle. So, using his right leg, he drew a line and asked the evil spirit to cross the line for battle and these what was and these was what happened just as proverb chapter 18 verse 10 says the name of the lord is a strong tower the righteous roam into it and they are saved 
actually the name of the Lord, a name that is above every other name, that at the mention of the name Jesus Christ, every knee must bow and every tongue must confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. The righteous run into it and they are saved. Also, Ephesians 6, verse 11 to 12, put on the whole armor of God that you may be able to stand against the works of the devil. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against rulers of the darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in heavenly places. But one thing is sure that to all these the Lord has promised to preserve our soul. For Psalms 121 verse 7 to 8 The Lord shall preserve you from all evil. He shall preserve your soul the Lord shall preserve your going out and your coming in from this day henceforth and forevermore. Isaiah 41 verse 10 Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous hand. First John 5 verse 18 For we know that whosoever is born of God does not sin, but he who has been born of God keeps himself, and the wicked one does not touch him. Psalms 91 verse 9 to 10 Because you have made the Lord who is my refuge, even the Most High, your dwelling place, no evil shall befall you, nor shall any plague come near your dwelling. Second Thessalonians 3 3 For the Lord is faithful, who will establish you and guide you from the evil one. You want to fight me? I didn't say that. No. You didn't say that. How can I fight you? Eh? I can't fight you. Oh, you said you're a man. You will fight me. No, I'm a man. And you said Daniel, I will deal with you. No. You said why did Daniel come to Zambia? No, I didn't say that. You didn't say that. No. This to let you know that the spirit speaking in her is gone. Okay? She's a normal human being now. For you to know that she's a normal human being, what she normally enjoys perfectly well. Let her taste it now and see the action. Okay? You said you're eating this before. Eat it. Watch. Eh? It has not tasted. It has not It can't taste good. It has what? The test that I was feeling first. I can't feel it now. You can't feel it now. It's tasteless. It's tasteless. Yes. Clap for Jesus Christ. She's gone. She's gone. Man of God, help. Sons and daughters of God, we should know that the Lord Jesus Christ is our protector. 
and his word offers us comfort, hope, and strength in times of need. When we are faced with trials, we can turn to the Bible to remind ourselves of his precious promises of protection, his care for us, and his power over evil. May these verses provide you with peace and assurance that comes from trusting in the Lord. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button as a way to support the channel. We are grateful for all your efforts.